Well, good morning, everyone. It's certainly good to see you again this morning. We're headed out to do leap work today. We have seven yards. I don't think I'm going to get all seven done. I'm going to really push to get six done. I might get seven. So, uh, let's go out here and see if we can get a little bit of footage because I haven't been getting a lot of stuff done. And I tell you, to be quite honest with you, it's been 22 degrees right on for the last several days. And I just haven't went out. So, I've kind of let them stack up on me. But I'm going to hustle. Now, the big problem is I am by myself today. But, with my... This is my, next year is my 22nd season. So with 21 seasons under my belt doing this, I ought to be able to knock it out pretty good. So let's, we'll see, we'll take some before and afters and we'll just see how good the yards clean up today. Well, y'all look at that. I got a flat just after saying how much I had to do and that just, I might try to blow it up and plug it I might try to do that just for now because I'm kind of in a hurry we'll see how it goes my tires deflated and they were pretty low so I'm only about a mile from my brother-in-law's uh, business he has a heat and air business and by the y'all, by the way, y'all, uh, anybody that needs heat and air done, he is highly uh, rated, and uh, people love him. He does a good job, and people love him. His prices and quality are certainly unmatched. But anyways, and I'm not just saying that because he's my brother-in-law. You can go on his Facebook page and. Uh, everything and you can see very very high rated response to his work so anyhow Matthew he had Matthew bring the air pump down and they got one tire blowed up good tire what didn't have the hole in it or anything but the other one's still very low so I'm going to go back to his shop and blow this other one up before it does the same thing this in here. It was really hot, but I don't think it got ruined by any sense of the word. I brought the truck over here to uh, the shop and my boy Matt made sure all the tires were full. And they were all really low. This cold air, you know, I mean, this coldness, it just deflated my tires. So he pumped them all up real good for me. They all got about five more pounds than they need. So uh, that way it'll account for all this cold we've been having. On the road again. I'm so glad to be on the road again. Oh, well, that slowed me down a little bit. Had to fill up them tires with air and uh but I'm, it could have been a lot worse i could have had to, a flat tire and have to change it but fortunately it blew up i'm glad i tried that before i pulled off the spare and uh all my tires were low on the trailer and everything trailer tires were down to 27 pounds but i mean when it's cold you know your air your tires do deflate so be careful about that fortunately i caught it and nothing was worse than it was but by the time I got that done and uh, filled up with gas and checked oil and everything, it is now 40 degrees. So at least it's warmed up some and it won't be quite as cold. Uh, I think I'm still going to be able to get everything done. It 
that only cost me, everything probably cost me, I don't know, maybe 40 minutes or an hour. Yeah. About an hour. But that's okay. Now we're going to head up and see what we can get done. Okay, let's see what we got going on here now. Got all these little persimmons. That's a mess. See what it does to the road. Yard, front yard's not too bad with the leaves. I'll be able to munch them up pretty easy. Go back here and take a look at the back. He wants me to blow the leaves off the top of his, uh, his roof there, he said. <laughs> eh, not too bad, not too bad. Needs a mow for sure. There's the leaves. Can y'all see them leaves on top of that roof? We gotta get them off of there. Alright. And then we got we got another yard over there to do. Got two yards to do here. So uh I think what I'll do first I think I'm going to uh I think I'm gonna weed eat this. Ordinarily I don't weed eat. But uh it's looking a little shabby. So I'm gonna go ahead and weed eat, clean up a little bit. Then blow all the leaves out where I can get to them. I gotta do that house right there too. Okay, it's not a whole lot bad there. Backyard might be a little bit worse because a bunch of trees over there. Let's get it cleaned up. Well, there they are, boys and girls. Both of them done. Had to go do the gutters on that that house right there. I had to climb up there. But they're all done. Two done. Hmm. Guess I got that stuff all on my face. Yeah, I got a little. That's okay. It don't mess me up too bad. Five to go. Okay, let's head to Maryville. I'm actually in the Knoxville area right now. My face looks dirty. Of course, I did just get through munching up a bunch of leaves. Went up the house, cleaned up some gutters. Oh. Okay, this is the next place I'm going to clean up today. A lot of leaves in the backyard. There's a pretty big piece of property here. Uh, she thought maybe I need to move all them leaves to the front, but I think I can blow these leaves, part of them, over on that side of the house, and part of them down here. I think I can clean them up pretty good like that. A great big limb over there. I gotta move it. Uh, 
Yeah, she wanted them pushed to the ditch, but we'll do the best we can. Ouch. Nice and clean. Nice and clean. Well, let's say let's go get another one. Three down, four to go, and it's 3.30. Not looking good. But if we get another one, then that'll be another one down. This was by far one of the worst. Took a long time. Whew. Had a lot of yard, a lot of leaves in that yard. A pile, a lot of them right there for the city to suck up. Does leaf dust make me look fat? All right, we'll see y'all next one. We'll see what it looks like. Well, here's the next one. It's definitely a blow and mow. I'm gonna blow the leaves out. There's not that many. And uh, I'm just gonna blow the leaves away. And uh, go ahead and you see these hedges here? I'm gonna go ahead and trim them down too while I'm here. Shape them up. Yeah, it's gonna be easy peasy. Not much to do. Better get with it. Well, 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 I didn't get it finished with that fourth yard. Uh, it's only 424, I could've gotten it done. I was. All I had to do is munch the leaves up. I already trimmed the hedges and blowed the leaves away from the house. But my starter went out of my mower. At least I'm pretty sure that's what happened. So I can't do anything there. So I'm headed to the house. I've had a few things happen today. 
that's okay. I feel good about today. I still got a lot done. I really wish I could have gotten the, uh, I really wish I could have gotten the, the sport yard done, but that's okay. It happens like that sometimes. Things happen, man. But you gotta go with the flow. But I'm tired anyhow. It's 5 o'clock somewhere. Almost 5 o'clock here. So good night, y'all.